favorite moment that has actually happened most recently. It was last summer, summer 2016, I saw Heather Headley play Suge Avery in The Color Purple. And there was a moment of me of pure magic when she did the number Too Beautiful for Words. And she was speaking to her stage partner with the most beautiful and most authentic and clear intention that the message could have been with or without music. And it just so happened that um, music was the only way that she could communicate. And I wept because I truly believe that she was speaking to another human being about how you are too beautiful for words and to believe that. And for Heather Headley to have delivered as an African-American singer, African-American musical theater performer um, was life-giving to me. One of the great things is that I think when it comes to pop music, um, or when it comes to commercial music in general, things you hear on the radio, you there's a lot of a uh, lot of there's like a very narrow category. I feel like of voices you hear that producers are willing to share from the African American female voice. And when I hear musical theater, I hear an array of voices that I don't necessarily hear on the radio. Um, if we're, we're going to talk about Hades Town, I hear folk. If we're going to talk about ragtime, I hear classical American theater, by, by Hairspray, I hear pop, dream girls, R&B, and it's just such a privilege to hear the array of voices. When I think of why should my voice be heard on stage, I think more broad and why should my voice be heard in the arts in general. And I think that if artists of color, specifically performers of color, want um, more authentic representation, more narratives to be told on the stage. I think that it's important for us to hold um, pe people in power in the theater accountable. And I think that that's challenging um, casting directors, I think that that's challenging producers, I think that's challenging directors, and making sure that there's clarity of approach and um, the clarity of approach to make more dynamic stories. The world is changing rapidly, especially with technology. And so we have the opportunity to be heard um, via on stage and let it spread via social media, let, it, let what we want become a global message. And it's also important that when we speak our truth, or when I speak my truth, I allow someone else to speak their truth. And I allow someone else from another part of the world to speak their truth. And we all start to realize at the end of all of this that we're human and that there is solidarity um, 